Okay, so here we go. This is something a little bit more for the newer players. Um, I want you guys to kind of pay attention to how this works. So if you guys are free to play and you're struggling with figuring out how do I get some red nucleus for my character or a banner or something you want to, you're trying to hope for, I just want to let everybody know that banner characters are 50% chance of winning. It is a coin toss. You're not guaranteed to get your banner character. So you, you, you know, there is sometimes a guarantee. Other times there is no guarantee. You just want to make sure that at that time level. Um, the, uh, so if you try to pull it, you can, there's a chance that you can get her them before the the 80 pull. There's a good chance that you could try to get her at the guaranteed level. And there's also a 50% chance that you could not get her as well. Some people are heartbroken by this situation. But with that being said, let me talk to you about how this works. So the Red Nucleus for free to play players in Mororia, you open up your tab here, your touchpad, and you can go to Vera, the Vera Plain, and go to Mororia. This map here in Mororia contains 10 red nucleus. And the 10 red nucleus can be found on interactive, I don't know what happened there, uh, can be found interactively through the map that I did show on our Discord. And you can locate each one of those. They're very difficult to, to attain. Some of them are pretty easy. Some of them take a little bit of a, little bit of a, a trial and error to get to, but you can get to them and they're free. Uh, Artificial Island also has two of them as well. That also is um, something I can post for a YouTube video that somebody else has done. The other way that you can go about it is at the bottom in your exploration. In the exploration, a lot of these um, places have uh, red nucleus. I don't think Astra or Asperia has, has them. But a lot of the areas that's in this game, um, like Artificial Island, I believe, has, um, yes, there is red nucleus here. So there's um, two for each of the, for this. And it also provides you with uh, matrix cards as well. Uh, the other place too is another place. So you can get two from there. And again, with the matrix cards, the... Uh, other places you can find these are in Mororia. That's also another good place. You can find them there. Uh, there's, you can see there, my map keeps glitching out. But there's six there after doing a lot of exploring, and that's finding nucleuses and things like that. You can get free nucleus for free uh, just by exploring. Uh, this, so there's quite a bit there, and hopefully that helped you. I'm sorry, there is a train in the background at the same time, and they're raining on the horn pretty good. So with that said, there's a lot of different ways that you can get that. Also, if people who are in Domain 9 um, as well, uh, these statues at certain times um, of the upgrades will provide you with a nucleus, and some of them provide you four gold nucleus as well. And again, these are also a good place to find your uh, free nucleus for reds. Um, there's also an inners, also has a, a six in total as well. You have to go hunting for them, but they are also in, in, in the Grand Sea and also in a few other places in inners, just so you know. And then again, same thing with this. Um, they have also, you can see, red nucleus you just, it takes a little bit of exploring but yeah you can get to it and um, you'll be able to to get your red nucleus for free and so for those people who are struggling trying to find out well how do I do that uh, how do I find these red nucleus I, I don't want to spend a bunch of money on on something if I can't afford it and do that other people can and that's it's a lot easier to pay for it if you can it is free to play so obviously you, you, there is a little bit of a paywall if you want to get some better stuff but then again they also provide a good balance of not having to pay every time so with that said 
that will help you get your red nucleus. You just have to do a little, little bit of a grinding thing to get there, but you'll get you'll get there. I've been able to pull at least four um, 80 pulls on the red nucleus just by investigating the areas. And the other way that you can buy them is through having 150 crystal, uh, dark crystal, not the blue one, the titanium. The dark crystal also, um, 150 each of those provides you with um, having red nucleus as well. If you can't, don't want to keep searching for it and you have a lot of nucleus, you could do it that way. So hopefully this helps you with the red nucleus ideas for not having to spend a bunch of money on your store to to pay for something like that if you don't have it if you do that's great that's a good easy way to do it without having to search everywhere quick and easy um, between 15 and 15 and 50 bucks to get at least a 30 or 40 pull and sometimes up to 100 depending on how if you if you're available to do something and that's us dollars so yeah i'm hoping that this helped you out with uh, Red Nucleus Hunt, and I hope that to see you out there. I will see you later, my fellow Questerians. And until the next video, goodbye.